Hi, this uh, is about a new feature of this plugin uh, that is rules. So you can define rules on based of um, product keys. So product keys uh, can have uh, different values. Uh, in this drop down you will see all the uh, possible uh, product keys uh, which uh, your products, your WooCommerce products are using at the moment and uh, whatever the values of those products for example if I show you uh, here are a few products sample one two three and total sales is a, a meta key and you can define more so in case you want to define a rule like like these these uh, products or this product should whenever it is being ordered so it should go in a uh, different uh, order status uh, a, a different WooCommerce order status so you can define a new key like uh, like uh, pre order item like this and if this key is saying yes or maybe uh, enabled or maybe uh, no or true or false whatever it is so you will define it like this uh, and for example I'm having a key like flagship is equal to yes so you will see that uh, product key here like this flagship or uh, when you will click on that so you will see all the all the possible values so uh, we, are, we are going to define a rule that if a key is flagship in a product which is being ordered uh, in a combined uh, order like multiple items order so if the key is ha flagship having a value yes so it should go to cancelled it should go to refunded or failed or it should go to processing and remaining should re be same as others right so for example if you are offering a product uh, which is on demand and you are not deciding the price of that uh, product yet so you can make it like pending payment so let's see add update rule so what will happen uh, this is a rule uh, for each key you can define one rule else it will be overwritten and you can delete as well like this okay uh, now I have an uh, order already here having three items in it one of them is the same product having flagship right so this order is worth 190 and as I'm using uh, bank account transfer uh, payment mode for testing so my order is on hold okay so what will happen when I when I will split this order let's see if I will click on split order icon so in fact uh, by default what should happen in fact uh, three orders will be created other than this parent order and all of those will have on hold status but if this rule will work correct so one item will go in this status okay let's try right so two items are same on hold and one item goes in pending payments so what will happen uh, this uh, this order can be managed separately you can ask that user to uh, pay you can uh, negotiate with them you can tell them what else uh, need to be done or by supplying that order you can remove this order and you can keep you can keep the other two other I mean you can and you can tell that a uh, customer that your uh, two your two orders are valid but one item is not in our uh, stock so 
we have split it like this and we are going to remove that order so you will be having one hundred and thirty dollar orders and we will refund you this one sixty dollar that's it something like that or you can say that uh, uh, I'm going to define a rule that if flagship yes then make it refunded like that so what will happen whenever this uh, product will be ordered it will be automatically refunded right so that's an amazing uh, feature a new feature in this plugin I hope you will like this uh, tab I'm not uh, adding it in a free version the reason is uh, the, the shortage of time I couldn't exactly uh, I, I, I tried to uh, maintain all those standards in the script but obviously if it will go uh, again in a loop of uh, testing uh, with the free version obviously uh, it can be a problem for existing users so existing users so it will be a problem but a pro version are you a pro, pro premium users are a few always premium users are a few so they can at least approach me immediately if they will face any problem thank you so much I hope you will keep uh, using this plugin and I'm going to work on another feature about uh, combining and the splitted orders I mean it's a reverse reverse of this uh, plugin so that's also in demand so I will surely work on that thank you so much